and a one, two, seven, eight.
Thank you, everybody. Let's, let's give it up for Chance Robson here with another patch cord. Yeah. Yeah. That's great. Uh, just to be clear, what I'm about to say is more for him than for you. Your scale's the same tonight, man. Don't think just because you performed on stage, there's more bread in it for you. I'm not made of money. Okay. This is said with love-ish. So, yeah, Chance, way to go. Let's give it a shot for a second, brother. I want you to be comfortable. All right, that's a winner. Okay, Oliver Gomez, everybody. Yeah, yeah so we're, uh, we're delighted to be here. Uh, this group I'm calling Nuvi. Rhymes with groovy, and uh, if you give it a look, N-U-V, it's new, and it's Roman numeral five, right? Uh, it's a quintet, so I can also do Nuvi with a V-I and get away with a sextet, but for tonight, we're going with, yeah, all right, good. Roman numeral fans in the house, yeah, baby. I've, I have a very, very narrow demographic that my jokes appeal to, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say everything to this table right here. Thank you. Um, anyway, we're delighted you're here supporting live music. This is Nuvi, and we opened with Twilight by Wynton Marcellus. The first set features a bunch of tunes um, that I haven't played before, and I suspect a number of people on the band haven't played before. We're just trying to create some new grooves, new vibes, new energy with different music. And also, the important thing with Nuvi for me is that the band be intergenerational. I'll talk about that a little bit more later, but you can clearly see if we're talking demographics, I'm in a different demographic than some of the people on stage. So it's nice to have the energy and, and independent voices of players in different places in their creative careers. So that's what I'm doing with this new endeavor, Nuvi. We're going to continue with a beautiful obscurity of Claire Fisher. I've played a lot of Claire Fisher tunes, but uh, this one is pretty much new to us all. It's called Brazilian Waltz. Thank you. 
Isn't that adorable? If that were a brooch in a jewelry store, wouldn't you take that home? Wouldn't you say, box that for me, please? So, yeah, uh, Claire Fisher is better known uh, for tunes like Morning or, oh gosh, what's the, Pensativa, you know, some of you might know Pensativa from the Art Blakey Free For All album, and a uh, great West Coast-based pianist for many years, but that's a bit of an obscurity of his, and I really, really like it, so great job, everybody. What an amazing band. Let's give it up for Stephanie Tata Iwa. <laughs> Bryce Winston. This is Oliver Gomez on the bass. And Rob Moore on the drums. So David was kind enough to mention tomorrow night here for uh, Let Me Shill Relentlessly for only $10 over in Ravenscroft Hall. You can hear big band music uh, from Sammy Nestico with the Basie Band, Duke Ellington. You can hear Maria Schneider, Bill Holman, all kinds of, Thad Jones, a lot of great big band music tomorrow night. The VJC Alumni Band is a big band and we're performing uh, tomorrow at 7 p.m. Feel free to come on by and as part of the plugging for the VJC, that is the Valley Jazz Cooperative and that's an educational initiative of Music Serving the Word Ministries, the parent organization to Ravenscroft and one of our many outreach ministries here at MSW. And uh, so I work during the school year with students in grades eight through 12 but after they have left me and gone to frolic in college for a while, we try and get them to come back in early summer and play with us to renew acquaintances. So it's a really nice thing. And I mention all that to say, we are actually selling some vinyl. Hey there, Chance, do you want to hold up some vinyl? That would be really great. Let's give it up for Chance. Oh, 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 we've had an interception of the vinyl there. So. So there's a recording I did a few years back called Anachromysticism, and it's a two LP, a double vinyl set right there. And Bryce is on it, Rob is on it. We recorded it as a quintet, but without these youngsters because they were almost certainly not born yet. And uh, so if you're interested in taking some vinyl home tonight, 100% of the sales of the double vinyl, I think we're selling it for $15 tonight, uh, two records, and 100% of those sales will go into the MSW Education Fund so they can support uh, like the VJC scholarship program and things like that. So even if you only use it at f as Frisbees or coasters at home, you're supporting young, uh, young student musicians. So I respectfully encourage you to check out Anachromysticism. Um, we're gonna continue with a piece. Oh, this is well-timed, almost like I planned it. Here's a piece. Is it true? It is. Here's a piece that's on that recording. It's called Percolate. Yeah, it's gonna be like this all night. I took my glib pills, but I, but I double dosed, I'm sorry.
I'm so impressed that they could play it exactly like it is on the record. That was really great. That was a note-for-note -note transcription of the record. That was very impressive. So, yeah, that's a tune I wrote entitled Percolate. There's really no melody, just sort of a giant text box of instructions. And then the last instruction says, or do whatever you want. <laughs> and that's true. Like, uh, they have such great creative impulses. I have my little puppet mastery thing as a composer that I'd like, but let's cut the strings and let people be creative. So, uh, yeah, so that's Percolate. Yeah. Thank you. So just a little bit about Nuvi and why the people who are on the stage are on the stage. I gig frequently with my buddy over there, Bryce, uh, who's up from Tucson, where he is uh, active with the Tucson Jazz Institute. In fact, he's one of the co-founders of the group. And uh, they have outstanding educational programs in Tucson that he leads, some of the best in the country, in fact. But we're blessed to have him on stage tonight. And also, uh, my friend and colleague Rob Moore, we're sharing a stage, which is really great. But in addition to these wonderful Arizona musicians, we have a couple people who've joined us from upstate New York. Back in February, I was uh, lucky enough to get to perform with the Eastman New Jazz Ensemble in Rochester, New York and uh, met these two fantastic musicians. Yeah, let's give it up. Was that for Eastman or Rochester? The greater Monroe County Metroplex, that's what that was for, all right. So I met these two musicians there, they're fantastic. I thought we could get them out, have them solo a little bit with the VJC alumni band, so they'll be featured at the end of the first half of tomorrow night's concert. There's another enticement for you to come out. And uh, also, to get them out here to play with the quintet, I've been thinking about as I get to, uh, uh, I might not be the lion in winter yet, but I am the lion in really, really late autumn. And so as I get towards the end of my active life as a pianist, I think if I've been teaching and the students have been moving farther away from me, I get older and the students are always young, right? So, but I don't know that a bandstand should look like that. You know, that I'm playing with some awesome musicians who are in their 50s and 60s and they're great and they're awesome. But I think with Nuvi, the last like major thing I'm gonna do is always try and put together bands that are intergenerational. So other voices need to be heard and I'm really grateful to the two of them for coming out from Rochester to uh, play with us tonight. And I know what you're thinking right now because I'm thinking it too. Hey Russ, more rock, less talk, so we're going to play Song Song by Ben Wendell.
All right, that was Song Song. Lovely tune by Ben Wendell. And uh, we're going to, I guess next we're going to do maybe the only thing that's familiar in my book. This is something I do on a regular basis. Um, it's a great tune by Roger Calloway with fantastic lyrics by Marilyn and Alan Bergman. It's called, I Have the Feeling I've Been Here Before. And uh, heads up to people in other rooms who have buttons to push. I'm singing on this one. All right, for our next number. the feeling I've been here before more often than I care to tell and though the view's been twice as clear before by now I know it pretty well summer turn to fall before the joke November makes of May the times I thought I'd had it all before then bit by bit it slipped away Though on the losing side that carpet ride is always worth a try I've seen the magic disappear I've missed the boat and shed a tear before The only news when you've been here Once more Is who will say goodbye
I've seen the summer turn to fall before the joke November makes of May. The times I thought I'd had it all before Then bit by bit it slipped away Always worth a try I've seen the magic disappear before I've missed the boat and shed a tear before The only question when you're here That's Stephanie Tata Iwan, alto sax. Yeah, bravo, sister. We're going to conclude the first set with a tune by my, uh, sorry, a tune by Wayne Shorter, but I first heard on a Miles Davis record, uh, Sorcerer, and it's entitled Masquilero. Um, hope you enjoy it, and even if you don't, we're coming back for a second set. <laughs> so. We'll take a little break, and uh, during that break, if you are new to the building, and I did see a lot of hands go up, so either people had shoulder cramps at the same time or you haven't been here before, um, David Bauer will be leading a tour of Ravenscroft Hall. You can see the awesome facility there. And uh, again, one last shameless plug, any sales of Anachromysticism, the vinyl we have available at the bar, $15 for a 2LP set. That money goes to MSW Education and can support the VJC Scholarship Fund. So thanks for your consideration with that. This is Mascalero.
Rob Moore. That's Rob Moore on the drums. Bryce Winston, tenor sax. Oliver Gomez, bass. Chance Robson, uh, bass patch chord. Yeah, man. Stephanie Tata Iwa, soprano and alto sax. I'm Russell Schmidt. We'll be back around 8.30ish, but for now, go frolic and maybe see Ravenscroft Hall. We'll see you in a bit. All right, how y'all doing? Awesome. How many of you took the tour? Yeah? All right. What'd you think? Needs more purple leather, doesn't it? I think so. Come back next year, we'll have covered the floors. So, all right. So again, we're gonna continue with our second set. I'm Russ Schmidt and this is Nuvi. We're gonna begin this set with a tune of Bryce's entitled Spur of the Moment.
Thank you. That's Bryce's composition, Spur of the Moment. And uh, we are back. Let me introduce the group. That's Stephanie Tata Iwan, Altone Soprano Sax. This is Oliver Gomez on bass. The composer of the last tune, that's Bryce Winston on tenor. And the composer of the next tune, this is Rob's composition, Monsoon Horizon. Ro uh, Rob, is there anything you want to tell the group about Monsoon Horizon? Uh, a storm's a brewing. All right, great. <laughs> All right, great. Sure. Yeah. I think he said two sports teams there, the Seattle Storm and the Boston Bruins. Is that? I don't think they play each other. First off, it's two different sports. Second, it's like a women's team and a men's team, and that seems inherently unfair. Well, when you love sports ball. Yeah, when you love sports ball, like Rob Moore. Yeah. All right, here's a man who's never heard anything on 98.7 Sports Radio, Rob Moore with Monsoon Horizon.
That's Rob Morris Monsoon Horizon. All right, and here's a contribution to the book from Oliver. This is a, a favorite monk tune of his entitled Green Chimneys. Um, for those of you who might be thinking it has something to do with a particular haze or smoke or anything, no, no, no. No, that's the name of the school he was sending his daughter to at the time he uh, wrote the piece of music. So it's the perfectly innocent Green Chimneys by Thelonious Monk. tempo do you want?
Awesome. Awesome. That's Green Chimneys by Thelonious Monk. We're going to continue with a Joe Beam tune. Um, uh, uh, someone uh, in the crowd asked me at intermission about uh, singing, and I mentioned that I never sang in public uh, solo until my dad died. And uh, he was an amateur singer, really awesome fella, and I was very blessed with him as an earthly father. He was great. Um, but a... Uh, a gentleman who would sing tunes like Make and Whoopi, which at a certain time were quite risque, so he'd get to the end of, end of some party or a Grange meeting, he was a farmer, and he'd sing Make and Whoopi, and he would really, his verb would be, oh, that always wows them. So, I have no intent of wowing you. I don't wow people with a meditative bossa nova by Antonio Carlos Joby, but... I do try and honor my father, and, and every once in a while I'll sing a tune. So I thank you for indulging me with that. This is a really lovely tune with an English lyric by, I think it's Ray, either Ray Gilbert or Ray Gilbert, and uh, it's entitled, If You Never Come to Me. Preparatory drink and throat clearing. What's the use of the ways that will break in the cool of the evening? What is the evening without you? It's nothing. It may be you will never come. to me What's the use of my wonderful dreams And why would they need me Where would they lead me Without you to know where
What's the use of the waves in the cool of the evening? What is the evening without you? It's nothing. the use of my wonderful dreams and why would they need me just where would they lead me without you to know Thank you. I'll work on that a little more. It's the first time I've sang it in public. It's a new addition to the library. I'm now up to six tunes I can memorize lyrics to. So, all right. We're going to continue with a lovely tune from Stephanie. Anything exciting to tell us about Sticky? It's a piece of hers entitled Sticky. Awesome. Yeah. And in her defense, it's, it's much more humid in Rochester, New York than Phoenix, Arizona. <laughs> Here's Sticky.
All right, you have been a faithful, supportive, loyal audience, and just for that, your reward is you'll make it home by 10-ish, so. Yay, let's give it up for the local news. You'll see the news almost certainly unless you live in Ahwatukee like me. So um, <laughs> bottom line is we're going to do just one more tune. We'll keep it short. I have no idea how that's going to work because it's a long form, but it's a, it's a kind of a messed up blues that I wrote entitled Blue. But I want to thank so many people before we play our last tune. Um, I want to thank Stephanie and Oliver for traveling here from Rochester. <laughs> And a reminder that they will be playing a couple of pieces of uh, Palo Alto by Lee Konitz and Waltz You Swang For Me by Thad Jones in tomorrow night's concert in Ravenscroft Hall. If you want to come by, 10 bucks, and it supports the VJC students. So I hope you'll consider it. And uh, then I also want to thank my other compatriots on the bandstand, great collaborators, Bryce Winston and Rob Moore. Yeah. And then we have a great team here at uh, Ravenscroft and in Jazzbird from our team. Hey, Jordan, how you doing? There's Jordan, everybody. She did not want me to mention her. There she goes. Okay. And uh, David Bauer and Stephanie and all the team here that really helps us succeed. A great audio support from Chance and Alejandro and other folks. Our bartenders, thank you so much. Hope... Hope you pushed the vinyl as much as you po uh, pushed the vino. So uh, there we go, a little play on words for everybody. And with that, yay, there it is. Oh, 15 bucks for two LPs, not one, two LPs. So, all right, thank you, sister, you're awesome. We're gonna conclude with Blue. My name's Russell Schmidt, and I'm truly grateful for you coming out tonight to support live music. And whether it's here or it's at other venues. We hope we will continue to support creative people wherever they are in live venues or, uh, you know, in, in plays and drama, in dance, in museums, whatever. Just keep uh, helping people who are young creatives have a world in which they can succeed. So please come out and continue to support young creatives. And with that, we'll play Blue. Thank you so much. It'll get it done quicker.
Thank you, everybody. That's Stephanie Tataiwa. Got Bryce Winston. Rob Moore. Oliver Gomez. I'm Russ Schmidt. This is Nuvi. And I hope you'll come back next week for Nicole Pesci. Go ahead and start lining up outside right now. Thank you and good night.